Well, we're here for our next chuck wagon race. Today we have Spurs McCoy, Dusty Trails, Hank Rivets, and Spud Malone. So the first thing you do when you uh, have a chuck wagon race with your four racers, uh, you roll the D6 and you go to the start, which is the barrel churn. And you'll see how they're going to rank them for the start. So we're going to roll a one. Rank the chuck wagons based on how many total qualities they have from most to least. So we have five for Spud Malone. We have five for Hank Rivets. We have five for Dusty Trails. And we have five for Spurs McCoy. So they're all the same. I think I'm gonna rank them by rider traits first. So those have three, these have um, two. And we'll just roll a die for each of them. White numbers go to Dusty, green numbers will go to Spur. And uh, it's a tie. And Dusty's ahead, Spud will be white, and Spud is ahead. So we have our races, the uh, chuck wagons coming out of the, the barrel turn, and that's how they are. And let's see how the race goes. First one. Track is a bit muddy for the fourth place. You, you read fourth place, third place, and second place, and you determine whether they move up or not. So track is a bit muddy and not going anywhere. Hank Rivet stays where he is. Move in a second spot if you have three rider traits, and Spud Malone does have three rider traits, so he's going to pass Spurs McCoy on the outside. Move in a top spot with Reigns, Guts, and Stoveman. He does not have reins, so Spud will stay there. We're going to our second card. Now, you can take the cards and put them every third card if you'd like to play the full 12 cards. I like to take the turn cards and just shuffle them in. So you'll have short races, long races. You never know when the race is going to end. And for me, I find that a little bit more fun. But if you download the game, you play how you like it. If you want to play... 12 cards and you just put a turn card at the very very end uh, so we have turn one coming up uh, move up one spot into third so hank rivets is going to pass spurs mccoy third spot move up one spot if you have the reins and guts quality he has the reins quality but not the guts quality um cannot catch the top guy spud malone we're going to the next card fourth place if you have a total more total qualities in the third place rider switch spots. He has five and he has five. They don't switch. Third place riders go into the unusual events chart. It's just gonna roll. We roll a nine. Rider has Reigns, Outrigger, and Stoveman. And he has, no, he does not. Uh, he moves up one spot. So he doesn't have Outrigger. So he's not gonna move up. Second place, move into first. If you have four or more rider traits, he only has three. So Dusty Trail still in the lead in this Chuck Ragan race. And we've got another turn coming up, coming up to turn two. You are stuck there, fella. You should have got a better start. Spurs McCoy still in fourth. Move up one spot. If you have four driver traits, he's only got three. Hank Rivets staying in the third spot. Second, move up one spot if the top rider has one horse trait. He only has one horse trait. So Spud Malone will pass Dusty Trails and he takes the lead. And that was the third turn card, was it? Oh no, second one, sorry. Um, here comes the third one. Four, switch spots with two driver two. If you have four plus driver traits, he does have four plus driver traits. Spurs McCoy goes flying up and him and Dusty Trails will swap out. Three, switch spots with driver one. If you have four driver traits, Hank Rivets only has three. He stays in third. Pass the top driver if you have four driver traits and he only has one horse trait. He's got four driver traits. Bud Malone has two. We're turning the card. We're coming into turn number three. One turn left. Bud Malone is in the lead. Fourth spot. Move into third spot with, with a great drive off the run. So Dusty Trails makes a pass on Hank Rivets. He goes by him on the backstretch. 
If you have stove man and drive traits, he does not have stove man. So Dusty Trails is not going to move up. Second, move in a top spot if you have three rider traits and power on your horse. He's got power. He's got four. Spurs McCoy takes over from Spud Malone and moves in a top spot. And here we come. We're coming down the back stretch. This is going to be the fourth turn. It's going to be the end of the race. Pass in a third. If the third race rider only has one horse trait, he only has one. Dusty Trails gets passed by Hank Rivets. Can he keep going? Pass in a second. If the second place rider only has one horse straight, he has two. Can Spud Malone catch Spurs Mal McCoy down the back stretch? Pass in a first. If the first place rider only has one horse straight, he only has one. Spurred Malone comes out on the back stretch. He comes across. Spud Malone wins the chuck wagon race. Spurs McCoy comes in second, Hank Rivets comes in third, and Dusty Trails come in fourth. So that is the Chuck Wagon Race. It's one of my favorite. I like it. I think it's kind of fun. Um, if you'd like to download this game, you can find it at gitchplay with two A's dot wordpress dot com and just look under free stuff and you'll see it. Uh, if you like this, uh, if you like this game, if you like the video, be sure to give it a like and uh, have a good day, folks. That was the Chuck Wagon Races at the Calgary Stampede.